guys so welcome back to my channel today we're doing an install on my client who has really fine hair so we're going to be utilizing micro keratin tip hair extensions and i've actually cut these full size bonds into quarters her hair is really fine and fragile so i wanted to make sure that i could use an extension that's really going to mimic her natural hair in terms of density and also in terms of texture so i'm using bellamy professional keratin tips and i've custom permed them for my client because i really wanted to make sure that she could wear her hair both curly and also styled i love to go in at the nape this is where my first section always tends to be working as low as possible while still being able to give my client coverage she did say that she wears her hair up in ponytails so i wanted her to have versatility within the unstore i am going in with a rooted shade here because i feel like that's what's going to look really really seamless in this area this is is a stunning shade and then I have the ability to mix in some lighter shades as I work my way up so now I'm going in with a highlighted shade this one is the shade hot toffee blonde and it is so beautiful I love the pops of blonde I think they look great and they add in just enough pop of color without looking overwhelming or stripey when I perm these extensions, I always make sure to go in with a few different size rods as well. I feel like that's what's really going to help mimic that natural curl. Your curls are always going to be tighter in some areas and looser in the others. So I actually went in and used about three different rods. Um, I used a really, really small one and then a slightly bigger one as well. And then that way she had really, really nice soft waves and also some more curly curls as well um, which looked really good within her natural hair perming the extensions gives it that texture as well so then when she does decide to blow out her hair it will smooth out really nicely but it will still mimic that texture that she has within her own hair i am continuing up the head I'm actually working really, really high as well because I'm essentially building my client a wig. I'm really working high into that crown, but I do have the capability to do that just because I'm using such teeny tiny micro keratin extensions. Like I said, I did cut them into quarters. Some of them were thirds. Um, I don't think I ever used a half just because her hair was so fine. So they are really, really small, but that's just going to give her that longevity without having too much weight on that natural hair. I also custom bonded some of them as well. So as I worked high into this section here, I also custom bonded them with a colored keratin. I love using colored keratin. A brown or a dark brown works really well because it's going to match my client's root color as well. Um, I can also control how much keratin I'm putting on that bond as well to make sure that it's going to look as seamless as possible within the hair especially in that crown area and also through the hairline you do want to make sure that they are as small as possible because like I said at the beginning my client does want the versatility to wear her hair up another thing that I utilize is comb line I love comb line. I think it's really great in the crown area. It's also fantastic around the hairline because you can create a bond that is so, so small and it just looks like strands of hair. How you're placing these comb line is you are placing the hair on top of the natural hair and you're not rolling it around the hair. You're actually combing it in so that it integrates with that natural hair and then you're stroking it with the adhesive and then with the brush to really make sure that you're working it into the hair. This creates an extension like no other because you can't see any visible point of attachment. It literally just looks like your hair and it is super duper lightweight and truly is a one-on-one -on -one density match. So that's why you're able to do it in these areas where typically a, another extension couldn't reach even if you cut the keratins down as small as possible, I feel like the comb line is just the icing on the cake and it worked really well here because like I said, she has fine hair so I wanted to make sure that I could give her as much coverage as possible. This is the finished result. I styled it just with some really, really nice beachy waves with the triple barrel and we are obsessed. It looks so natural and so beautiful. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and please don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel.
Bye, guys.